a different route to Barry Island this morning. From my house, I'm going via the lake, which is on the west side of Barry. And as you can see, lots of wildfowl there. And also there are uh, koi carp in there. I think people have, uh, have thrown their old um, fish in there after they got big, too large for their tanks or something. And uh, there are a number in there, quite large fish. Eww. I don't know whether anyone catches any. <laughs> and down there we have the model boat enthusiasts. And they're quite interesting to watch. Some of them go at quite a pace. Uh, that one's not doing much at the moment. Uh, some swans having a little look at what's going on. Like they don't seem to worry about the boats. You think they'd chase them, wouldn't you? It's a fast one. Yeah. Wow. Look at that. Ooh, should keep it in my camera really, but uh, not easy to do handheld with the phone. There he goes. And there they are. Again, from the other side, this man getting his boat to do ring a ring of roses or something, checking it out. It's a lovely lake. It's always been a, a very popular place. It's shaped like a Welsh harp. If you saw it from above, it's uh, in the shape of a Welsh harp. As I say, it's on the west side of Barry. Always good to go there. And this is adjoining it, which is um, used to be, that used to be the outdoor swimming pool years ago. And we come across to Watchtower Bay, which is next door to Barry Island. And there's a quite an immense of sand there when the tide's out. Didn't used to be, used to be a lot of mud there, but the sand has built up a quite a lot around there. That's your watchtower slipway there. I used to use that with my speedboat years ago. And I had a speedboat a long time ago. I used to do some water skiing. And as you can see right in the middle there, that's the uh, the harbour wall. And they used to the Waverley used to come in there, the paddle ship the Waverley used to call there. You remember seeing that? And this is just overlooking the, the immense the immense of sand. As I say, it was all mud and, gr and uh, grass at one time, uh, you know, watery grass, obviously. And there's still some there. But um, I, I wish they would do something with it, spend some money on it. And it would be a lovely area for um, boating when the tide's in, because the tide comes right up to the rocks the other side. And uh, that's a nice little beach. A lot of people like that beach. There are a lot of beaches in Barry. There it is again from the other side. Quite a few people down there considering the time of year. But then it gets a lovely day today. Absolutely gorgeous. And that's the path leading to Barry Island. And there it is over there. The lovely, wonderful Barry Island. And you can see they've, um, they've uh, cleaned the beach again. As they do every day in the summer. All those lines across there, all the, the the sand is raked in the mornings. Some guy gets up early in the morning to do that. And here we go now, we're at the other end, and we're at my destination. I'll be in there in a few moments for um, tea and a tea cake. Bye for now, thanks a lot for watching.